And I, I think this is one of the biggest uh, challenges for the seats. The challenge here is the seat. The challenge here is the seat. It's a bronze. It's called the world war trophy. The bronze is the world so 50 is a small I so it's 57. So 50 is the ones that I have done as they have been in my body, swing, and the EM no classic feeling in the in the break in the park. That was that point. And the mat is open. No, Rich wasn't there yet. Yeah, Rich was still with you. And then the mat is an old friend. I have done that twice and I was invited last last year to go, but yeah. So because I am developed a nice relationship with the owner of the event at the club, he's really experienced. So, so, so nice. And you always contact me directly. Hey, I'm not going to TSA, whatever. Tell me how much you want. Yeah, no, absolutely. Last time it was like, hello. No, no, no. I won't, I won't make that.
Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to take your seats, we'll be starting the first match very soon. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Cleveland Skating Club Open PSA 2021 Championships. We are about to introduce our first match, so if you'd like to take your seats, if you can. Okay, our first player is an English international, currently ranked number 29 in the world, and the winner of the Irish Open in 2014. Here to attend the semi-final tonight, ladies and gentlemen, Adrian Waller! <laughs> Our second player this evening for the semi-final is the US Open last 16 finalist, which was played last week, is currently ranked number 42 in the world and started on the tour, PSA World Tour, in 2013. Ladies and gentlemen, Patrick Rooney!
Okay, I don't know. Okay.
Don't go out the shot. 4-3.
out. Three. And out. Eight all.
goes to the bag. There's no way for me to move. You, 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 were, you were so far from that ball, you have to go there and play. Tony. From the right, 5-2. From top. Tony. From the right, 5-2. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> 
<laughs> the lowest beat chord wasn't deep enough. Wasn't deep enough. From the left, A5.
just left. There are, there are two decisions. This one is a left. No, that, that doesn't seem that you, you missed completely your shot. So, it's a left. So, 8-5 to the left. We're not going to keep going on this. 8-5.
Fifty seconds. Water leaves, two games to one. Water to serve. A ball.
Hang out. Four, five.
second and, and managed to hold on again he came back at me but I think by, by the middle of that second I started to pin him back behind me which I needed to do otherwise you know he'll take me apart at the front of the court so I had to, had to limit that and you know I did just just long enough that I could um, sort of take away those attacks from him in the middle because yeah I've done it before and he's, he'll just beat me so quickly if, I, if I'm not disciplined in my in my line hitting so really pleased to get off in that in three because that was Every game. Um, going into this match, was there any uh, special preparations you made uh, to play uh, Rooney again? Because obviously you played it before and it went to five, I think it was 11 eight in the fifth. Um, so, was there any special preparations you made today for, for this match? Um, not really. I, I just told myself to, to go hard from the beginning because um, last match, I say three match balls against him, he, he really had the upper hand against me and I got away with it on that occasion um, completely so I knew what I was up against and I just needed to, to hang on in there and, and conserve and just play my game when I could because as I said I knew from that other match as soon as he got on top of me I, he was just going to make me work and work and work until I couldn't do any more so I hung in there and, and managed to, managed to get, get it done. Well congratulations ladies and gentlemen. We have a two minute break, we're going to let's get a drink and then come back to your seats for we'll introduce the second match of the evening. Thank you. 
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the semi-finals of the Cleveland Skating Club Open 2021 Championships. Our first player this evening joined the PSA Tour in 2010. They have a current ranking of 43 in the world and has six tour titles to their career journey so far. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Nathan Lay. Our second player for the semi-finals tonight, our second semi-final, our second player won four titles back to back in 2017. Current world ranking of number 23 in the world, all the way from Egypt, ladies and gentlemen, Mohammed El Shabini. Okay. 
We can only ask for life, and then I'll make the decision. Two one.
to Ashwini. Yeah. And that three seven. Yeah, it's so good. 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 Yeah, it's so good.
Then we resume in 60 seconds.
They were resuming 60 seconds. They will resume in 30 seconds. 15 seconds. There's a court case.
Nine
Right. Right side.
Gentlemen, what a fantastic match for our second semi-final of the evening. Ladies and gentlemen, Mohamed El Shabidi and Nathan Lake. <laughs> Mohamed, thank you. That was a fantastic match to watch. I'll see you another couple of seconds before. <laughs> It's a great match, Mohammed. Can you come and give us a couple of words? It was really, really impressive. I mean, we didn't know which way that was going to go. I believe that was a 3-2 match, a five-setter. Uh, it really kept us glued to our seats there. We wanted to see every point, every second. Um, you guys were getting around the court to every corner. Again, amazing use of the front two corners as well, and some very precise length there. Um, obviously, the movement is obviously mesmerising as well. Can you tell us what you what you did and what you were doing in your game tonight that you think brought you the win? Uh, well, I was surprised with his performance. To be honest, uh, I haven't played with him since three years. He's been playing amazing, and uh, his his tight drives are really was putting me in a lot of trouble. Um, the first two games, every time he asks for a net ball, the referee gives him a stroke. So he just, you know. So weird, you know. But I try to play and just, you know, focus on my game and uh, not give me the mic now. Don't have it. But you know, the referee was doing really well today. A lot of pressure on him. I don't blame him, but I'm glad that I uh, I managed to just play good squash and focus on my game and win. That's great stuff. That's very useful. Yeah, there were some nets and strokes there. I think they went both ways. Um, actually, on that note. Hang on, hang on. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for our referees tonight. They're doing a fantastic job. Thank you so much. But also, on this note, could you give uh, Mark uh, Anderson and Anne Lavelle a big hand for all their efforts as well? 
fantastic effort, hang on now. Thank you. So, <laughs> Mohammed, come on, come on, you don't need to sit down. Oh, you might do. Yeah. And can I open that one? Okay. <laughs> oh, thank you very much, I appreciate it. Okay. Thank you, Darren, you doing an amazing job. Thank you so much. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to hold you anymore. Into the final, it is Mohammed El Shabini. So, ladies and gentlemen, that's our last semi final tonight. Thank you so much for coming. Tomorrow is 6 pm. 6 pm. Please don't forget, 6 pm is the final and the start. So, come in at 5 30 if you like. Come in at 5 if you like. It's fine. Come get your seats. Get ready. We'll see you tomorrow night. Thank you very, very much. Good night.